What's up everyone? I'm John Connor and today we're going to hack music theory with Ableton's fold function. Let's check it out. So I loaded up Serum here, but today we're really looking at a MIDI clip. So in session view, I'm just going to double click here in the clip slot and make a new MIDI clip. I'm also going to make this four bars worth of time just because I like at least four bars when writing melodies or chords. So today we're going to look at how to fold a certain scale of your choice. So we're going to start and keep it simple with A minor, which is all white keys. So I'm just going to double click here on every white key from A to A. That's A minor. That's the code for a minor scale. I'm going to select everything. I'm going to hold option and make a copy of it. I'm going to go an octave up an octave down. Okay. And then the next thing is select everything. Command A is the key command. Those key commands are crucial. Okay, and then we're going to use our left arrow on our keyboard, move into the negative space here, and then click fold. And now we have A minor up three octaves, and every note you play here is going to be within your scale. Another quick thing you can do with it now that you have the minor code here with these MIDI notes, you can move it up and down to different keys and choose whatever scale you want. So I could go to G, and that's G minor, or A flat, and that's A flat minor, and now you fold it you have A flat or G sharp minor across the board. That's it for today's tip. Let us know down below in the comments how that helped out with your workflow. Again, I'm John Connor, and you can book me as a mentor on peermind.com. See you for the next one. If you're an aspiring music producer and ready to evolve your sound, find out more about our San Francisco ground campus, online classes, and one-on-one -on -one mentorships at peermind.com.